Do we have a Nissan Ariane Nismo in the works? I don't know, but they say the devil is in the details. Let's then delve into the details. It already appears that Nissan is working on something as an answer to the Ionic 5N. So take a look at this on the screen. This is a development view that may be a precursor to the Nissan Aria Nismo. Just hold on for just a second and hear this. This car is wearing one of the 6-2-tone paint wet options already offered by Nissan. And while there are no official comments regarding the high performance Aria yet, it is safe to assume that this upgraded EV will have more power on the top than the regular Aria doing 389 horsepower, guys. This Aria, which has been lapping around the normal brain, has a few aerodynamic aids absent from the regular car. And I'm going to elaborate. But before that, we want to say a big thank you to all of you for the love and the support. A like and a subscription would make our day and keep the channel going. So let's keep the business going. Now, there are a few giveaways. So take a look again at what we have here. And there are a few giveaways that this electric car is not your average area, guys. It wears a modest body kit with a rig profiled front bumper wearing a lower lip spoiler. While at the rear, there is a compact spoiler integrated below just the, the back window with redesigned red diffusers and side skirts, guys. So let me just be a bit specific. At the front, Look again, the new Fascia reveals a lower lip spoiler. You see that? And then when you turn to the rear, take a look at this one. The roof gets a subtle spoiler. And as if that is not enough, there's another appearing just below the windshield. And the bumper also seems to have been, you know, detailed a little bit different the front and the rear bumper as well. Elsewhere, what, I, what I'm seeing is a Michelin Pilot Sports 4 rubber wrapped around 20 inch wheels and the front brakes appear a little bit bigger. But we'll delve into that. Now, speaking of wheels, note that the 20 inch blacked out alloy wheels fitted on this test car are not a design you would find on the UK configurator today. That is telling us that these rims don't look especially large though. It's slab side electric car. Although the tire choice is certainly more sporting than the eco tires on the regular Nissan. So these are sticky Michelin Pilot Sports 4 in 255 by 45 rim 20 spare. Still on the microscopic details, the brake disc looks slightly larger in diameter. It may be to me, but I see it a little bit larger. Although it's hard to verify this from the pictures, guys. But then the rotors certainly don't look significantly abraded here. But these are a few of the details that we have picked up and uh, uh, may be giving us a sign of the fact that this may be a Nissan Aria Nismo. But then the question we are all asking ourselves is how much powerful will a Nissan Aria Nismo be? Now, this is a million dollar question. And currently, the Aria offers a choice of two-wheel drive and e-force all-wheel drive to handle the twin models that produces 388 brake horsepower and 443 power feet of torque. It's enough to spoof this from 0 to 62 miles per hour time of between 7.6 seconds and 5.7 seconds respectively. And um, and this whole version would focus more on sports air looks and handling a remapped de deployment to give a more dynamic performance. And this is the path chosen for the latest Nissan Leaf Nismo, guys. All of this really depends on how much Nissan wants to challenge the impending slew of Go Faster EVs, including the Hyundai Ioniq 5N, the Kia, e the Kia EV6 GT, and then the Tesla Model Y performance. This would give Nissan a rival to the Hyundai Ioniq 5, one of the coolest electric vehicles on the market now, and the Boda Y performance. The former is actually packed with interesting features like a drift mode, simulated gearbox, and pedal, a system, a system that helps create weight transfer on a corner entry. And the Tesla Model Y, on the other hand, is hugely popular and offers over 450 brake horsepower, guys. So we expect that you know, if this is the Nismo Fertile Daria that is headed for production, it will get both more power and some clever tech design to increase engagement. 
And we can also expect substantial suspension upgrades uh, and Nismo typical red accents to adorn the body and wheels like this unofficial rendition. So take a look at this one and that one. Great. So Nismo in the past hasn't been shy and we believe that there is an there are updates coming this week for this content. Now, once the path becomes clearer, we will update you on the Nissan Area Nismo. So don't forget to subscribe for the latest updates, guys. Thank you so much. Have a good radio until we see you time again. Bye bye.